We're going to open up my first fingerling today. A spooky fingerling. Coming up after this. Thank you so much to Wowee for sending this along for free for me to review it. Uh, if I had to choose one of these, this is the one that I would have chosen. So awesome. And look how cute he looks normally. But he's got some secrets going on. I have other fingerlings. I never got around to opening them. They keep getting better and better. Canada actually had fingerlings super early on before anybody was talking about them and I wanted to get one of the monkeys I wanted to get the black monkey and I finally did get it I got that at Treasure Run. I got both of these at Treasure Run actually and then I noticed they have dinosaurs and they keep getting scarier and cooler and cooler and this is probably the coolest yet these are gremlins and you can get four different kinds and I'm going to tell you what it says on the back here. My eyes light up. My head spins 360 degrees. I hope it comes with batteries. My teeth retract. And I grip onto anything. From grin to grim with just one spin. And all of that is written back there. That's what I was reading. Don't turn off the lights. <laughs> uh oh. The one that I have is Scaredy Cat. But you can also get... Junkyard, that's a really cute name. Hip Hop, I like his name too. And Evil Gigi, <laughs> who is a unicorn. 30 plus sounds. Thank you, Wowie. Well, let's get it open. Are you guys having a good October month? Where are my scissors? I'm so behind on my Halloween reviews. I'm gonna have to do more than one a day to do all of the videos that I had plan to do. Maybe I'll do that. This is exciting. So much stuff. There's a lot of different languages. I guess we have instructions for three different languages written there. English, Spanish, and French. And they have an on and off switch on their heads. It says, pet your Grimling's forehead. Pet once or continuously for happy, loving sounds. <laughs> this is exciting. It says you switch it on like here. And... and is, is, is this where you put your finger? Okay, now if I pet it here. It likes that, okay. It's purring, it's purring. <laughs> okay, that is adorable. So far, it's cute. Gently blow into microphone. Gently blow once or twice to make the sneeze or react in different ways. I don't think it likes that. It's sneezing. Okay, I heard it definitely sneeze. And then it says, shake your gremlin. Head twitches and spins. Eyes glow red. Oh no. Oh, it looks angry. Oh, its eyes are glowing too. Oh, it doesn't like to be shaked. Don't shake the baby. Don't shake the baby. Don't shake the baby. Oh, it got angry. Okay, yeah. This is really fun. Make your gremlin fight. Hold forehead sensor for two to three seconds to make them fart. I don't know where the forehead sensor is. Oh, I made it so mad. Well, I can't make it fart. 
Clap once for a happy sound. Clap twice, and he'll turn grim. Okay, I want him. I want him to be happy. Let's put him down here and let's see. Okay, those are happy sounds. Okay, and then. Oh, what a bad baby. Oh, it's such a bad baby. I want to see that again. I want to see that up close. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Kremlin. Bad, bad baby. And hang them. Hang them upside down to have them react in grim mode. This is also going to make him very angry. Don't shake him. Oh, he doesn't like that. Cradle your gremlin for sleepy reactions. Oh my goodness, it's mad. It doesn't want to go to sleep. Oh, it's a bad baby. You can remove the little tag on its ear, which is really cool. And see, it's got a little <coughs> nick in its ear. And then you can take the little animal tag and clip it in or clip it out. That's really cool. It looks like I'm going to have to practice at making... <laughs> looks like I'm going to have to practice at making it fart. I kind of like bad babies, and this probably is my favorite fingerling. Oh. I want to thank Wowie again for sending this very bad baby along. If you want to see me take a look at the other two that I have, stay tuned at the end of this video. Thank you so much for liking. I hope you <laughs> thank you so much for watching. I hope you will like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you next time. baby okay I'm gonna take a look at the monkey first considering that was the very first fingerling will this make it be good one clap means be good no it's gonna take longer for it to go to sleep two minutes I believe it takes for it to go to sleep so I'm a huge fan of monkeys. So the fact that that was the first kind you could get. Now I notice that the arms on the monkeys are a bit softer. His arms are very tight. So he's got a tighter grip on you. This is a softer grip on this guy. Okay, his head is much smaller too. But that is what the monkey looks like. He's got a little tuft of blue hair. And just like on the other one, there's a switch on the back. Swing them, pet them, rock them to sleep. Cute noises. Yes, you're cute too, I'm sorry. And the eyes blink, look at that. Very realistic. And then it says, let's pet it and see what happens to it. Love the monkey noises. And then what happens when I shake it? And then let's see if I can put it to sleep. I can't get my fingerlings to go to sleep. To sleep. It's up. It woke up, it woke up. Okay, let's check out the dino and hear what noises it makes. This is the untamed version. My name is Razor. So that is the one that I got. And you can get them in different colors. I chomp and growl. I react to your touch. I'm alive. Moving head and eyes. I think they're going to keep each other up.
those plastic boxes wanted. Okay, are we ready for the dino? The dino has a combination of harder legs and softer arms. Can you guys be quiet, please? Please, please be quiet. Oh, this is scary, too. Wow, he makes scary. Wow, he makes super scary toys. What's this cockadoodle do like a chicken? I like the tails. Oh, and it's opposable tail. Goodbye and good night. Go to sleep, little dino. It is so cool how the new ones took them to the next level with the glowing eyes. You can blow into this one to get kisses. Kisses! It looks like. I've got some major fun ahead of me, playing with my pets and painting them all, and um, it looks like it's going to be an all-day job, and I don't know if I can handle it!